Good afternoon, students. My name is Dina Khalaili. Just call me Dina. I'm from Deir Hanna village. It's a beautiful village in the north. I will be your teacher today. Come and have fun with me. Okay? What will we do today? Okay, so we will learn one of the E sounds, which is A. We'll talk about it later. We will read new words. We will learn the meaning of the new words, and we will have, of course, some fun. Okay, I want to ask you a question. Can you say the short E sound? Do you know it? No, I don't think so. Can you write the letter E? No, I don't think so. Can you read new words? No, but don't worry. At the end of the lesson, you will know how to do it. What you need for our lesson? I would like to bring a board, markers, a notebook, and a pencil. Okay, so I'll give you 30 seconds to go and bring them and come very fast so we can learn and have some fun. Okay, uh, now I have two of my friends. I have Ted and I have my pet cat. Now, what I want you to do is to listen to a very beautiful story. When I was a kid, my mom t t told me lots of stories. I want you to listen to the story because I like to tell them and you should listen very well. So this is Ted and this is my pet, pet cat. Okay? It's 10 o'clock. Ted, Ted, wake up. Get up. It's 10 o'clock. Get up. It's 10 o'clock. It's 10? It's 10? Oh no, Ted is late. It's 10. It's 10. Ted, you can't have eggs. I want eggs. No, you can't have eggs. It is late. Go. Hmm. I can't have eggs. Hmm. I can have eggs. Very good. Hmm. Yummy, yummy eggs. Okay. I want to try to remember one of the words that I said in the, uh, in the story. Can you remember anything? A sound? A word? Let's try to remember together. So we heard ah. Where do we hear the word, the sound ah? In Ted? Egg? Mmm, yummy eggs. Ten? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten? My pet cat. So these words have the eh sound. Eh sound. Look how I say eh. Eh. Look how I do my lips. Eh. Eh sound. Again, Ted, egg, ten, and pet. Very good. Now, this letter is the letter E in English, but the sound. Soto, the sound is e. Eh. Let's write the word, the uh, letter e eh in the air together. We go like this, down, across, and in the middle. The small e eh is a half circle and down. Let's write it on your board. Bring the boards in your marker and let's write it on the board together. So. We start from here, from the top to bottom. We go like this, this direction. Here, we go down here, and we have eh. Sorry. 
my bed. And we go to the small a, a. Again. And the small one. And, of course, we have one here. Okay? Let me uh, try to make it better for you. Sorry, the lines are wrong. Okay, now like this. This is the eh. Very good. So we start from here, we go there, down, here, and then in the middle. Again, down, in the middle. From here to here. And the, the small a eh is a, uh, we begin inside out, a half a circle. Again, half a circle. From inside out, half a circle. Now you try it on your boards, on your boards. Please start, okay? It's very easy, I'll help you, don't worry. So we start like this, and this, great job. We start like this, and this, on your little boards that you have at home. Yes. Very good. So this letter, we call it E, but the sound is eh. Look at my mouth when I say eh, eh. It's very difficult to pronounce, to say, because we don't have it in Arabic, okay? We don't have the sound. So you have to practice it a lot. We have to say eh, pen, eh, egg, egg, eh, okay? Don't worry. I will help you to know it very good. Okay? Now, I want you to listen to the words, listen to the words very carefully, and think where is the sound eh? Where is it? In the beginning of the word or in the middle? Listen to this word. Egg. Egg. Where is the eh sound? Where is the eh sound? Yes, very good. We hear it in the beginning. It's in the beginning of the word egg. Eh. The next one. End. The end. The end of the movie. The end. End. So the word end. Where do we hear the eh sound? Great job. We hear it in the beginning. Very good. In the beginning. Eh. End. Great job. The next one. What is this? Elephant. Elephant. Where do we hear the sound? Eh. Elephant. Yes. In the beginning of the word. So what do you know now? You know words that start. Great job. You know words that begin and start with the sound eh, which are egg and Elephant. Great job. Now, I want you to listen now very carefully to the new words. Now we hear we have a new word, but listen to it very carefully. Men. Men. Where is the e eh sound? Is it in the beginning? Men. No, it's not in the beginning. Where is it? Yes. It's in the middle of the word. We say men, men. Very good. The next one, pen, pen. Listen, pen. Where's the eh? I say pen. Yes, great job. Pen, the eh is in the middle of the word. Very good, you're very smart. Now, red. Red, a red marker. Red, where's the a sound? Yes, very good. We can hear it in the middle of the word. Very good. Desk, where's the a sound? Desk, hmm, where is it? Great job, it's in the middle. Very good, I say desk. 
What is this? This is a net. Net, like internet. Okay? Okay? Yes. Where's the a sound? Net. Yes, very good. Great job. It's in the middle. <gasps> ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Where's the a sound? Yes, the a sound is in the middle too. Ten. Now, now you know which words have the a sound in the middle. We have men. We have pen. We have red, we have desk, net, ten. Okay, now let's play a game. What do you think? Do you want to have fun? Okay, so let's look at these words. We have here pictures. One word is different. How is it different? The a eh sound can be in the beginning or in the middle. Which word is different? The a eh sound is not like the others. So let's look at the words. We have men, pen, red, desk, and, and ten. Which word is different? We, we can't hear the a eh like the others. Very good. And, and the a eh is in the beginning, but men, pen, red, desk, ten is in the, uh, is in the middle. Very good. So, and is different. Look at these words. We have men, pen, elephant, desk, net, ten. Which word, the a eh place, where we hear the a, eh, is different? Yes, very good. Elephant. Where's the a eh and elephant? In the beginning. Very good. And men, pen, desk, net, and ten. Where are they? The a eh sound. Yes, in the middle. You are so smart. Great job. Now these words. Let me read. Let me tell you what they are. Okay, don't worry. Elephant, red, egg, and end. Which word do we hear the e eh sound in another place? Which one is different? Think. Yes, great job. Red is different. Red, very good. So red, the a eh sound is in the middle, but elephant, egg, and end, the a eh sound is in the beginning. Very good, great job, smart kids. Now, these pictures, who can try and tell me what is the first one? Great, desk, the next one, elephant, yes. Egg, great job, and Great job, you're very smart. Look how you remember all the words. Great job. So, which one is different? Yes, very good. Desk. Where's the eh sound in desk? Great in the middle, but elephant, egg, and end. Where's the eh sound in the beginning? Great job, very smart. Now, now we are going to learn new words. And the number of sounds and letters. So let, let's look at the first word. This word is pen. We have three letters and three sounds. Pen, we have p, e, n. P, p, or e together are p with n, pen. So three sounds that make the word pen. Okay? So pen, say pen, pen. Very good. Again, say pen. Pen, we write with our pen. We write with our pen. Pen, say pen, 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 pen. Very good. We write with our pen. The next one. What is this? Egg. Oh, yummy eggs. We eat eggs. Yes, egg, egg, egg. We have three letters, but Two sounds. What do we hear when we say the word egg? We hear egg, egg. Together they are egg, egg. Very good. The next one. Red. I have a red heart. Red. 
Very good. So we have r, e, d. Three letters and three sounds. Red, r, e, d. We have r and e together. R, e, d, red. Okay. Very easy. Red. Say it with me. Red. 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 Red heart. Yes. Very good. Net. Internet. The net of a spider. Net. Okay. So net, we have three letters and three sounds. We can hear net. N, e, t. We have three sounds. Now, take n, e together. Ne and it. Net. Easy. Net. Say net with me. Net. Very good. Very good. The next word, ten, ten. What are the sounds? Who can tell me which sounds do we hear when I say the word ne? Uh, ten, sorry. Ten. Yes. T -e -n. Ten. T -e -n. Ten. So we have t and e, t and in ten. Very good. Very good. Ten. Ten is a number. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very easy. Ten. Okay? Okay. Now we have riddles. What does riddle mean? It's a guessing game. I will tell you clues about a word. You have to guess. What is it? Is it a pen? Is it a net? Is it red? Is it ten? You have to think. Okay? So, listen. The first word is, it's a word that has three sounds and three letters, okay? Three sounds and three letters. It is small, can be small that much, and we can use it to write. What is it? Think, 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 think. Great, great job. It's a pen. It's a pen. Three sounds, three letters. We use it to write. Very good. The next one, it has three sounds and three letters. It can be black or gray, and it can be big or small. What is it? Who can tell me? What is it? Think, 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 think. What is it? Yes, great job. It's Annette. It can be black or gray. It can be big net or small net. Yes, and it is a net. Very good. The next one. It has three letters and three sounds. It is a color. It is not pink. It's not black. What is it? Great job. It's red. Very good. It is red. Very good. The next one. It has three letters, but two sounds. <laughs> three letters, two sounds. Which word has two sounds here that we talked about? Two sounds. And we can eat it. Yes, great job. Great job. It's an egg. 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 Two sounds. Very good, very good, very good. The next one. It has three sounds and three letters. It is a number. It's not one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It is great. It is ten. Very good. It is ten. Ten. Very good. Okay, now here we have an activity on your boards. So please bring your boards and your markers, okay? So we can do this activity, okay? The activity is like this. I will look at the words in front of you. I will tell you a word. You have to find it and write it here on the board, okay? Write it on your board. So I will say number one is, I'll give you the word. You have to find it and write it here, okay? Ready? Let's start. Number one. Number one is 
red. Look for red from these words. Look for red in these words. And write it down on the board. Okay? On the board because it's fun. Write it on your boards. I'll wait. Don't worry. Take a few seconds. Great job. Yes. Great job. So number one is red. Great job. Yes. Number one is red. Number two, look for the word egg. Look for, look, try to find the word egg. Remember egg? We eat egg. Yes. Number two is egg. So write the word egg. Where is it? Okay, did you find it? Great job. Number two is egg. Very good. Number three. Number three is ten. Ten. Where is the word ten? Try to find it. Ten. Yes, great job. I know you can do it. Number three is ten. The first one. <laughs> ten. Okay, are you ready for the fourth one? Number four is pen. Pen. Where is the word pen? Do you remember what we do with the word with a pen? We write with the pen. We use it to write. Pen. Pen. Very good. So this is number four. Number four is pen. And number five is the one who was let. Who would like to read number five? Yes, great job. Net. Net. Very good. Write net, please, on your board. Okay, great job. Now, let's go to matching, reading the uh, words and matching to the picture, the correct picture. So we have a red pen. Who can look for the red pen in the picture? Let's match. Which one is the red pen? Yes, great job. This is the red pen. The next one, 10 desks, 10 desks. It's hard, right? Just try it. Ten desks. Say it with me. Ten desks. Again. Ten desks. Which one is correct? Yes, very good. Very good. Okay, now ten red pens. Ten red pens. Which one is ten red pens? Yes, very good. Say it with me. Ten red pens. Ten red pens. Very good. The next one. Ted's egg. We have here Ted, but Ted's egg. Which one is Ted's egg? The first one is Ted's pen. Okay. The next one is Ted's net. And the third one is, yes, Ted's egg. We can see Ted with an egg. Very good. The next one. The men's net. The men's net. Look at the first one. The men's, what is this? Pen, yes. The next one is the men's net. Very good. Very good. The men's net. This is the correct one. Okay. Here, what I want you to do is to look at each line. Each line, we have a word that is different. The place of the eh is different. So I want you to put, uh, to underline it, okay? For example, we have bed, red, ted, and we have egg. Which one is different? The place of the eh, the place of the eh. Where's the eh? Yes, very good. So egg is the one that is different. So I want you now to think and look at the other three uh, lines and think of the word in each line that is different, okay? Think of where is the eh? Where is it? In the beginning or in the middle? You can start.
Okay, how was it? Was it easy? I'm sure it was, okay? Because I really believe in you and I really know that you are very smart. So let's go to the next line. Who would like to read it? Yes, ten, elephant, and egg. Which word doesn't belong? Which word is different? Yes, very good. Ten is different. So we can see that ten, the E, E is in the middle, but elephant end and egg are in the beginning. The third one, and met men read. Which word doesn't belong? Which word is different? Where is the E? Eh? Yes, very good. We can see that and uh, is the different word from uh, met men and read. The fourth one, we have desk, ten, net, and end. Which one is different? Where's the E? Eh? Yes, great job. And is the different one. You are very smart. Look how well you are doing. Very good. Okay, now let's match. I'm going to read the word. Okay, you have to put, you choose the picture that is correct. Okay, let's start. Ten. Which picture is ten? Yes, great job. Picture four is 10. Very good. The next one. Who can try to read it? Great job. Net. Okay, where's the net? Number three. Great job. Very good. The next one. Red. Red. Where's red? Yes. Number five. Very good. The next one. Who would like to try to read this word? I know you can do it. Yes, great job. Egg. E egg. Very good. Which is number one. Very good. The next one is men. Yes, very good. Men. Which picture is number uh, is uh, the word men? Yes, picture number two. Very good. You are very smart and you can do it. Look how well you are doing it. Wow, you deserve an, uh, a, a very large, big and huge and a warm clap. You are very smart. Well done. Great job. Look how many words you know now. How many words you can read now. Let's try to read them. Yes. The first one is 10. Very good. The second one is men. Very good. The next one is, come on, come on, come on, come on. You can do it. Red, very good. The, next, the fourth one is net, very good. And the last one, egg, very good. You are very smart. Look how many words, you know their meanings and you know how to read them, wow. Great job. So now you can say the short eh sound in words. Now you can write the letter eh and now you can read new words. Well done, students.